Cochlin and Eckersley 50s dash Derbyshire hopes in Durham. The demons that have haunted Durham's batting so far this season were banished on day one at the Emirates Riverside. Alex Lee set the tone for his team, at times appearing to be playing a different game to his colleagues, and his vigil was rewarded with an 84. And the loss of the opener did little to derail the hosts. All-rounder Paul Coughlin finished the day on 46 not out, as he and Ned Eckersley frustrated the Derbyshire attack late on. It took little time for Coughlin to reach his half-century. A wide Aitchison delivery was dispatched to the boundary just four balls into the day. Derbyshire's hopes of retaining top spot were taking a beating at the hands of Coughlin and Eckersley. Their partnership was soon worth 100 runs. Eckersley played his way to his first 50 of the season. A tip and run off a short Hudson Prentice delivery was enough to take him to a 139 ball half century. Just four of his runs came from the boundary. Another batting bonus point arrived for Durham. The side breached 300 runs for the first time in the campaign. The wicket Derbyshire were desperate for came on the stroke of lunch. Coughlin, 10 runs short of his 100, chopped a wide Critchley delivery onto his own off stump. Two balls later, Critchley had another, Potts his fourth scalp of the innings, another man bowled by the spinner. The late wickets meant Durham would reach the break with nine overs remaining in their first innings and the score 318 for eight. Three balls into the restart, Derbyshire had another. Salisbury out caught at slip by Wayne Madsen off the bowling of Barnes. Eckersley enjoyed himself, ramping Barnes and wrong-footing Connors to add to his now-growing boundary count. But rain put pay to any further play. The day brought to a premature end with Durham at 337 for nine and Derbyshire's hopes of retaining top spot in the North group all but over. They'll be desperate to pick up the final quick wicket early in the morning on day three before getting their own first innings up and running. Rapid runs will be key if they're to force a result with the forecast less than friendly.